Hundreds of people ran for cover overnight as gunfire erupted outside a nightclub in Liberty Village. Three people were shot and another victim was run down by a car fleeing the scene. Shannon Martin is live from King and Dufferin tonight. So Shannon, do we know what prompted the shooting? Yes, Mike, we talked to police today. They said, as you mentioned, this street was full of people. It was 3.30 in the morning. People had just left the bar after a caravan, a party, when two groups started fighting, and that turned into gunfire. The bullet hole came through here. From the outside, the damage okay. is barely the visible, but under the hood... And went through here, severed all the wires, and now we have no idea where it went. Even more frightening when it happened, Sashi Quirk was sitting in the front seat. She jumped inside for cover as soon as shots rang out. It must have been pretty chaotic. Yeah, it was. It's crazy. Hundreds of people were in the street after a carnival theme party let out at this nightclub in Liberty Village. Two groups were fighting when guns were pulled. 15 to 20 rounds were fired. Police say it's a miracle more people weren't seriously hurt. Three parties were shot. Uh, they all suffered uh, non-life-threatening injuries. A fourth person, a woman, was hit by a car speeding away from the scene. She was taken to hospital and is expected to be okay. In daylight, evidence of last night's panic is everywhere. Discarded shoes, bottles of booze and broken glass. By midday, the mess was cleaned up, but those who live here are still talking about it. I've never heard of anybody being shot, beat up or anything like that. It doesn't really happen too often, but you know, you always do kind of uh, watch your back a little bit after that. This once industrial area has seen a population boom. New condo towers and businesses moving in, including this optometrist. Ritesh Patel calls last night's violence an extreme rarity and not a reflection of all the good that's happening in the community. He opened his shop last year and just bought a condo nearby. People look out for each other here, uh, which you know makes me very proud to, to not only have a business here, but also to reside here very shortly as well. And you're looking live at security cameras outside of Cinema Nightclub. Police will now be reviewing that footage along with cameras all over the neighborhood. And they are putting out a call to any witnesses to come forward because, Mike, so far, witnesses don't seem to be cooperating in this case. Reporting live from Liberty Village, I'm Shannon Martin. Okay, thank you, Shannon.